My name is George Papandreou. Um, can you talk about the status of democracy now in Greece, the cradle of democracy? Well, I believe that we have a democratic challenge around the world right now because uh, we have a globalizing economy, but our institutions are national. Our democratic institutions are national. And that means that um, uh, there is a lot of power being concentrated in the global economy in the hands of a few. It could be in money, it could be in media, it could be in technology, uh, which is not uh, under any democratic oversight. Uh, whether we call them uh, rating agencies or whether we call them uh, the CDSs, uh, the credit default swaps, or whether we call them the um, tax havens, uh, this allows for for um, a lot of power to be concentrated, which is which is beyond our citizens' reach. For for example, in Greece, we have uh, a lot of tax evasion, and tax havens around the world, of course, help this. But this is robbing our people of the capacity to deal with the debt burden, but also with growth. Do you support the Occupy Wall Street movement? I support well, much of what they're saying, because there are obviously different views, but I think the, the central idea that we need to not only redistribute uh, uh, income, but we also need to redistribute power in our society is absolutely necessary to rejuvenate our democracies. And I see that this is a global challenge. It's a challenge in Greece. I think one of the reasons I myself had asked to proposed to go to a referendum uh, was to give ownership to the Greek people about the future of our of our country and say to the to the markets and to the European Union to the rest of the European Union yes we will do what's necessary but we want to make this our our our, um, our own own decision and uh, what what role did Goldman Sachs play uh, in what's happening in Greece today in uh, the economic crisis well obviously a um, number of um, uh, Firms such as Goldman Sachs have played uh, a crucial role in the in the financial crisis around the world. We are uh, still in the process of investigating uh, the um, the role of Goldman Sachs in Greece. There has been a parliamentary committee set up, uh, and uh, we will have um, the results uh, hopefully soon. How did Goldman Sachs benefit by giving additional credits to Greece? Yeah, this was this. These were practices that in the, in the past were considered legitimate practices, uh, not only for Greece but for many other countries. But uh, in the end, uh, these were these innovations were the um, uh, what what brought down uh, not only Lehman Brothers but um, the, the whole financial situation just a few years ago. Unluckily, to the detriment of the man or woman in the street. Uh, but uh, we, we haven't really seen uh, the banking system uh, being uh, revamped, and, and this, I think, is a, a key issue. We need uh, real regulation uh, around the world uh, to deal with the issues such as uh, naked CDSs, tax havens, uh, transparency in the banking system, more democratic decision-making. Uh, this is absolutely necessary if we want to have a sustainable economy.